Welcome to RiotTool.com. In this video, I will cover up about workspaces in Agile Central or Rally. So let me explain you what you will get it from in this video. I will cover here about creating workspaces and doing several operations like how to create workspace, update and manage workspace, edit details or if we need we can delete it, the workspace if it is coincidentally added inside our organizations. So if you are new to this channel consider subscribing and pressing bell icon for more updates. Let's begin with practical demo. Here post login in rally you are able to see the screen will be available for you. From here, if you have administration permission, then only you can perform operation on workspace level and you are able to see the setup icon is for you. Now, go to the setup and from here, you have to select workspace and project. If you want to create a new workspace, simply go to actions and click on new workspace the new window will appear for you and the detail of your workspace like demo workspace demo works. then discussion about your workspace state is definitely going to be open and now if you want to select any default project access for new workspace then click on view editor or something like this now we do have time zones as well based on your locations or region you can select your particular time zone date and format you can keep it as ddmmyy it's totally up to you which format you're looking for to add it but right now i'm selecting ddmmyy one day is basically going to be for your organization work culture if you are having five days working cycle select only five days monday to friday and saturday and sunday holiday for you this is going to help you in sprint planning or capacity planning then if you want to do rank method like manual ranking or drag and drop ranking you can select whatever options you are comfortable for it enable time tracker will give you time tracker facility available for you and they are already by default keywords are assigned to every state like user story, defects, tasks, test cases, defect suits. So if you want to change the name, you can otherwise keep it like the same way. Now date and time format is also available. You can add date and time format and the owner name, you can select the owner whoever you want to keep it. Now post adding all this detail, click on save and close and your workspace is created for you. Let me remove this. Yes. This one is a required field. So give it to it. And now save and close. Now you can see demo workspace is created. Click on plus tab and you are able to see by default one project is available here. You can also create a child project inside this or you can create project for demo workspace or simply clicking on this. For editing details about the workspace, click on edit sections and now you are able to see same screen is available when you have created a workspace. Post updating the fields which you are looking forward to update it. Click on save and close and this workspace is saved for you. Now if you want to do several other operations like adding projects you can simply add it. Customizing fields you can also do that. Tags if you want to add new tags you can use it and add it. Now if you want to add new any new items simply click on new and then you will find it out new workspace creation window is available. 
print details if you want to print these details which is available on your screen you can select and print details added options which i already covered it up now in field section you will find it out all the fields which is available for your workspace you can see it here if you want to add new custom fields you can simply click on new fields and that field will be added for you after providing the details and the drop downs list you can see it different options are available each and every items fields are available here but it's not restricted to anything you can add it from any point of time in settings tab the print option is available if you want to export workspace custom fields all types simply click on this and it will be exported in some formats so this is all about how to hit up workspace and do the operations so if you like the content consider sharing within your circle and don't forget to like and subscribe the channel for latest update thank you for watching